the cast of Victorious, Then and Now. This girl doesn't know if she's good enough to go to school here. What do you people think? In this video, we will be looking at the cast of Victorious and where they are today. So you want to break up? No, I, I didn't say that. I'm just saying. Are you guys might break up? Can you believe that this March will mark the 11th anniversary of the hit Nickelodeon sitcom Victorious? Victorious premiered on the channel on March 27th, 2010. Come on, give Tori a squeeze. <laughs> the popular show followed Tori Vega and her friends at the performing arts school, Hollywood Arts High School. Over its run, Victorious won two Kids' Choice Awards and was nominated for four Primetime Emmy Awards. Years after we said goodbye to the oddball students of Hollywood Arts, we catch you up on what this talented cast is up to now. Let's look at where the cast are in 2021. Victoria Justice, Tori Vega. This wheel and that creates electromagnetic electricity which flows through this transformer and then powers the robot. <laughs> After Victorious ended, Victoria Justice went on to appear in many other TV shows and movies. In 2015, Justice starred in the short-lived MTV thriller Eye Candy as Lindy a woman who suspected that one of her online dates is actually a serial killer. The following year, Justice played the iconic character of Janet Weiss in the TV movie The Rocky Horror Picture Show, Let's Do the Time Warp Again. She also appeared in the movie Naomi and Eli's No Kiss List, alongside Pierce and Faudet. In 2019, she starred in the coming-of-age film Summer Night, where she played Harmony. Justice has also made appearances on TV shows such as American Housewife, Man with a Plan, Robot Chicken, and The Real Bros of Simi Valley. Upcoming, Justice is slated to appear in two movies, Push, which is in post-production, and Afterlife of the Party, which is in pre-production. Additionally, Justice has also been working on music. On December 11th, 2020, Justice released her first single in nearly seven years, called Treat Myself. She has also recently joined the Recording Academy. This past year, Justice also hosted the 2020 Kids' Choice Awards, which was a virtual event due to the ongoing pandemic. Leon Thomas III, Andre Harris. Grandma, listen, there's no way you can drown at my school. You're not gonna fall in a toilet. Look, look, I gotta... I gotta... Leon Thomas III's character, Andre, was Tori's first friend at Hollywood Arts. Thomas has been busy with both acting and music since Victorious ended. After Victorious, Thomas appeared in three movies, Bad Asses, Runaway Island, and Detroit. He also appeared in episodes of Robot and Monster, Fear the Walking Dead, Insecure, and Satisfaction. Most recently, you might have seen Thomas portraying Rel in the short Creature. Upcoming, Thomas will appear in the animated flick Adventures of Bunny Bravo, where he will play Munch. In 2013, Thomas released a single with rapper Wiz Khalifa called Hello, How Are You? The following year, he released a new mixtape called Vibes. He also released an extended play called Genesis in 2018 with his album Rostrum Records. Thomas is also a songwriter. He even wrote the song Song To You that he sang on Victorious. This is called Song To You. <laughs> and he wrote four songs on his former co-star Ariana Grande's first album. Additionally, Thomas works as a music producer. With Christopher Riddick Tynes, Thomas is part of the production duo The Rascals. In 2015, Thomas won a Grammy for producing Tony Braxton and Babyface's R&B album Love, Marriage, and Divorce. In 2016, he was the producer of Post Malone's album Stony. He has also produced some songs off of Ariana Grande's most recent album, Positions. Matt Bennett, Robbie Shapiro. I want the cookie! <laughs> After Victorious, Matt Bennett has kept busy with both acting and music gigs. His first role post Victorious was reprising his character Robbie on the Victorious spin off Sam and Cat. He appeared in two episodes Hashtag Mama Goomer and Hashtag The Killer Tuna Jump. He has also appeared in other popular TV shows such as The Big Bang Theory. Shameless, Game Shakers, Fresh Off the Boat, Grey's Anatomy, and American Vandal. Movie-wise, Bennett appeared in three movies in 2015, including Me and Earl and the Dying Girl, The Stanford Prison Experiment, and Manson Family Vacation. Starting in 2013, Bennett was the host of a series called Nerdy Jobs on the YouTube channel Nerdist. 
In this series, he went behind the scenes of nerdy jobs to teach viewers about them. He is also a musician, and he released his debut studio album in 2016. The album, called Terminal Cases, was inspired by different Robin Williams movies. In addition to all of these projects, Bennett has appeared in two of his former co-star Ariana Grande's music videos. In 2015, he was in the music video for One Last Time, and in 2018, the pair teamed up again to collaborate on Thank You Next, where they recreated a famous scene from Bring It On. Elizabeth Gillies, Jade West. Ooh, you don't look happy. I'm not. Elizabeth Gillies got her big break in the Broadway musical 13, and after the final episode of Victorious, she returned to the stage. Gillies was cast as Courtney in the musical Jawbreaker. While Jawbreaker did not make it to Broadway, she did participate in the reading in Manhattan. Gillies has appeared in many TV shows, such as Winx Club, American Dad, The Penguins of Madagascar, Sex and Drugs and Rock and Roll, Robot Chicken, and Welcome to Wayne. One of Gillies' most notable roles has been her lead role in Dynasty. In Dynasty, Gillies plays Fallon Carrington. The show won a People's Choice Award in 2018. She has also appeared in various films such as Animal, Killing Daddy, Vacation, and Arizona. Gillies also appeared in Ariana Grande's music video for Thank You Next, where she played Katie from the 2000s cult classic film Mean Girls. She also appeared in the singer's 2020 music video for Stuck With You, a collaboration with Justin Bieber, which had many celebrity cameos. In the summer of 2020, Gillies released the extended play Songs From Home with Seth MacFarlane. On August 8, 2020, Gillies married Michael Corcoran, a music producer, in a private ceremony. The couple now resides in Atlanta. Ariana Grande, Cat Valentine. Okay, help is on the way. Thanks for calling North Star. <laughs> Ariana Grande became the most well-known star of Victorious, and one of the biggest stars in the world. Grande starred in the Victorious spin-off Sam and Cat, which ran on Nickelodeon from June of 2013 to July of 2014. She also appeared in the show Scream Queens, and the TV movie Hairspray Live, where she played Penny Pingleton. Even though she did some acting after Victorious, Grande is best known for her work as a singer. She released her first album, Yours Truly, in 2013. This album was followed by My Everything, Dangerous Woman, Sweetener, Thank You Next, and 2020's Positions. From these six albums, Grande has released numerous singles that have gained popularity, including Break Up With Your Girlfriend, I'm Bored, Break Free, Into You, No Tears Left To Cry, Seven Rings, and Rain On Me. Her video, Thank You, Next, which had a few of her former co-stars cameo in, became YouTube's biggest debut in history, with over 50 million views in the first 24 hours. Grande won her first Grammy for Best Pop Vocal Album for her album, Sweetener, in 2019. She was also named Spotify's Most Streamed Female Artist of the 2010s. Grande is currently engaged to Dalton Gomez, a real estate agent. Avin Jogia, Beck Oliver, I know it'll make you feel better. Jumping jacks? <laughs> Kiss me. Let's do it. Avin Jogia, who played aspiring actor Beck, went on to star on the ABC family thriller, Twisted. In this show, Jogia played Danny Desai, a teenager who was convicted of murdering his aunt as a child, who returns to his hometown after spending five years in a juvenile detention center. Since Twisted only lasted one season, Jogia went on to star in the Spike miniseries, Tut, where he played Pharaoh Tutankhamen. Jogia has also appeared in other shows such as Last Teenagers of the Apocalypse, Ghost Wars, Ghost Wars, Now Apocalypse, and The Stranger. One of Jogia's most well-known roles was playing Berkeley in the 2019 movie Zombieland Double Tap alongside other big Hollywood names such as Woody Harrelson, Jesse Eisenberg, Emma Stone, and Zoe Deutsch. He has also appeared in movies such as Streets of Hope, Ted 2, The Drowning, A Midsummer Night's Dream, Paper Year, and The Artist's Wife. In 2019, he released a book called Mixed Feelings, Poems and Stories, where he wrote about his experience of growing up mixed race. Catch Jogia next in the 2021 film Resident Evil, 
where he plays Leon S. Kennedy in the movie based on the popular video game series. Daniela Monet, Trina Vega. Mine! Mine! <laughs> Daniela Monet, who played Tori's older sister Trina in Victorious, has kept herself busy within the past few years. In 2013 to 2015, Monet was the host of the Nickelodeon series Awesomeness TV, a show that combined sketches, music video, and hidden camera pranks. She also appeared in episodes of various TV shows such as Melissa and Joey, Turbo Fast, Sea Dad Run, Nicky, Ricky, Dicky, and Don, Baby Daddy, Paradise Run, and Cousins for Life. Since Victorious ended, she also appeared in movies such as A Fairly Odd Summer, where she voiced Tootie, Rachel's Return, and Aloha Surf Hotel. Monet also has a YouTube channel and website that she uses to share recipes, fitness routines, beauty tips, and more. She appeared in Ariana Grande's music video for Thank You Next as a cheerleader. She also released a single called Unreachable in 2016. Monet is engaged to Andrew Gardner. The couple have one son, Geo James, who was born on September 29, 2019. They are also expecting their second child, a girl, who is due early this year. There you have it, the cast of Victorious then and now. Let us know in the comments down below who your favorite was. We'll see you in the next video.